To access your Salesforce data from Click Cloud Data Integration, you need to authenticate the connection with your account credentials. First, you need to create a new connected app. Go to Setup and expand the Apps menu. Select App Manager and click the New Connected App button. Name the app and the API and provide your email address. Enable OAuth settings and set callback URL to https connector.click.com slash auth slash oauth slash v3 dot htm. Add the following OAuth scopes. Manage user data via APIs. Access unique user identifiers. Perform requests at any time. Select Configure ID token and set token valid for to 720 minutes. Scroll down and click Save. Select Manage Consumer Details and insert the authentication code that has been sent to your email. Now you have the consumer key and the consumer secret that you need to paste into the connection settings. In your Click Cloud tenant, go to the Data Integration Home. Click Data Connection and then click the Create Connection button. Select Application Connection and select the Salesforce connector from the list of data sources. Select a data movement gateway to use when replicating data. Then insert the Salesforce instance. To find your Salesforce instance, click Setup and select Company Settings and then click Company Information. Copy your Salesforce instance and paste it into the Salesforce instance field. Paste the client ID and the client ID secret. In the login domain, insert your custom domain or if you are using the default production domain, use login.salesforce.com. When done, click Authenticate. A window is displayed with an authentication code. Copy the code to the clipboard and return to the connection dialog. Paste the code and click Verify. When the connection has been verified, click Create. In the Metadata Manager, you can define metadata for the connection. Click Generate Metadata to create metadata based on sampling the source data. Select the source data sets you want to use. When done, click OK. Select options for scanning the data. You can perform a full scan or a quick scan. A full scan will be more accurate, but may take a long time to process. If you select full scan, this data will be used in the initial load when landing data. You can also set default metadata settings. When you are ready, click Generate Metadata. When metadata generation is finished, you can use the connection in a landing or onboarding task. And that concludes this video. Thanks for watching.